<laughs> you can be bi-located out of time. I don't have a blackboard here, but uh, you know what a sine wave is? It's like, uh, you know, a line with a curve above it and below it, right? Okay? Now uh, you're manifested here above and below that line, okay? But when you're in the center, cross that line, that's where there's no time. That line is called a timeline. So the more pulses you have up and down, the higher the frequency is going to be. But forgetting that, just that, know that you're manifested above and below the line. In theory, you didn't have, have emotional density here. Your thoughts wouldn't control your reality, okay? And what happens is your thoughts, as you the sine wave goes up and comes back down to the center line, okay, going across. What happens is the next pulse, which is the bottom one, would contain your new information on your new reality and manifest on the second pulse going down or, or going up, okay. Each time you approach that timeline, a straight line, you know, zero time, that's when your new reality starts. Okay, what the creation light shift does is, plus you're not here, you get that timeline. Okay, no manifestation. So what the creation light shift does, it takes that little dot, we'll say, and spreads it out. Okay, so now you're in zero time. So you're physically here, doing your same pulses back and forth, okay? It manifests because you are frequency. But when you're not here, they take you to the ship, and the light doctors will work with you. 